hearing straight from the interim director after that big town hall at the Phoenix VA. BC 15 Sarah Goldenberg taking action to hold the leaders accountable for the change that they promised. And Sarah, you're the only Valley reporter in on this. Yeah, Stephen, this is the first interview with the new director in charge. Glenn Griffin, along with several other VA officials, took questions from veterans at a town hall tonight. He's the third interim director at the Phoenix VA since the scandal broke. Glenn Griffin came back from retirement to serve as interim director of the Phoenix VA. I've had my whole life serving veterans, and that's why I'm here again. At the town hall, allegations of a secret wait list still stung for many veterans. And I would like to be treated as well as my fellow veterans with the respect and dignity that we put our lives on the line. Griffin says it's getting better. The wait time still up to 90 days in August, now cut in half. New patients now wait 41 days for a primary care appointment. It's not good enough. We get a lot of veterans coming to see us, but we're going to get better. And 30 days for mental health appointments. We also do some screening. So if the veteran is significantly in harm's way, and, and, or if they use the suicide hotline, there's no wait. They're instantaneously Veteran Stephen Leroy Jackson suffers from post-traumatic stress disorder. 30 days to wait for a PTSD, for a PTSD appointment is ridiculous because in that time frame, this person could really get into any kind of mess like, you know, and, and actually hurt someone. He wants to believe change is possible. We would like to get a fair shake here. I believe it can happen. Uh, it's not that the VA is the enemy of the veterans. You will see in the next few months that uh, we're making a difference. Glenn Griffin will be here for the next year as the VA secretary tries to find a permanent director. Now about 30 veterans showed up at tonight's town hall and there will be more of those coming soon. Next Thursday, the VA is hosting a town hall at the Gilbert Clinic. Back to you. Yeah.